Alright, so take a walk. I mean, if worse comes to worse, I'll, just, I'll have to tear it up. I mean, it'll come up easy just by pulling on it. I don't have to worry about damaging the wire, so I just put the tractor on it. I can pull it right out. Uh, the problem is putting it back in again. Uh, you know, because then I'll end up with more of a hole putting it in than I did with it coming out because the stuff's not going to want to work quite as easy going back in. Now this is where I got the break. This is where I broke the pipe. It's an irrigation pipe actually. The wire is up there. This end it broke. The other end it broke down there. So right about, uh, well, I'm going to think right about here is where we have a breakage. Uh, where the wire broke. Now, I'm also thinking that we may have a blockage someplace. So, without me going nuts and having to cut up the whole yard, which I guess I can just dig in spots and then couple it back together. But anyway, I'll see. Hopefully, it's within the length of this. And I can see it. And then if I can see it, I can probably rig something to grab it so I don't have to tear all that up. So that's where I'm at. So, let me get down here for a minute. Ah, you know, you have these little trials and tribulations, but you know what? As much as it is, sometimes, oh, being a homeowner is a pain in the ass. You know what? I enjoy it because it keeps me active. What else would I be doing? Looking for something to do. Now, I'd rather be doing something that I'd like to do versus something that I have to do. But, uh, can you guys see that okay? Yeah. Um, this is what I'm going to stick in there. First, got to stick it in the phone. Uh, and then hope I can see it. Okay, now. Uh, let me find it. we got to find the app. The app, the app. Okay, now, I think... Yeah, okay, there we are. See? Here's me. It's hard to see me, but here's me. Now let's stick this down inside here. So far nothing. So far nothing. Nothing. I don't see any cordage yet. Oh, this is waterproof by the way. What is that? No, it's just crap. I don't see any cordage. It's bright yellow. So it would definitely show up. Ah! Cordage, see it? I don't know if you guys have seen that or not, but that bright yellow, that's cordage. See it? Now, how far down is it? We are approximately five feet. So it's right about here. So let me see what I can do. Let me unplug this. Let me put all this away so I don't accidentally step on it. And uh, I'll be right back. All right, so. I got an old 22 brush here, and I got a snake here. So hopefully, if this doesn't work, I have a piece of uh, thin metal that I can use. What I'm going to do is tape this to the snake, and uh, the brush will actually catch on to that wire easier than me trying to put a hook and hook it. Because I can get this down there and twist a little bit. right onto it. They'll get caught in the, in the brush. That's what I'm hoping anyway. It's actually a little bit easier I think than going back and forth trying to nail it with a with a little hook on the end of it. On the end of a wire. So in this case I think this will be fine. So we're gonna see what happens if I can get this brush out all the way. Kind of like push it down and turn it, and go a little deeper if I have to. Let's see what happens. Not yet. All right, it was there. I'm just catching on to it. Actually, I guess I can just run it down in there. Get a few twists. See if I can catch it this way or not. I hope that I'm not just pushing it in there any further. So let's see what 
that. I think I feel a little tugging, but I don't know. I don't want to end up pulling it off the brush. I think I got it. I think. Okay, how far do I go in there? Oh no. That lose it? Where's that train, Matt? Yeah, I'm back here far enough to. I'm almost there, and I'm hoping I don't lose it. I got it. There we go. Yeah, see, it was all clustered up in there. Eh? Uh, but like I say, the brush grabbed onto it without a problem, so that's good. So, uh, so this is a good sign. This is a good start. Okay. Apparently, it was getting caught in water because it's wet. So, but that uh, little camera thing in there worked out real good. Okay, now this is probably the end. This is the extra. This is all the extra crap that I pushed through that I said I had too much to start with. And now I got jets going over. Oh, fuck. All the neighborhood today, isn't it? Now, let me go down. Go ahead, let's take a walk. I'll take you with me. So anyway, I think I'm taking you with me because I can't really see anything in the monitor right now. The sun's got it all bleached out. So that's where it broke off. Alright, so this is where we're at. Let me give a little bit more wire. Yeah. Put a little catch on it there so I don't have to worry about it. So this is where we're at. So what I'm going to do now is pull through the other side, put a fresh piece of wire on it, and hopefully we'll be able to pull it through here. And if there is any little kinks or blockages, uh, hopefully uh, I can get them through. This cordage is pretty good. Uh, so we'll see what happens. All right. So we'll go back up this way again. Took two vacuums. Now this one believe it or not, didn't have as much sucking power than the little one up there. The little one up there was sucking like crazy. This one here just didn't have it. So I used that one to help blow through while this one was doing the sucking. But again, once it got caught in the water, it just gathered up in that little water puddle. Guaranteed, that's what it was, because the cordage is wet. And when I put it down there, it looked kind of blurry, so almost like I was underwater to start with, so I think that's what it was. So. Alright, so, now that I got more of this to play with, there. Let me, uh, uh, cut that. Get it all off the, uh, the brush. I knew the brush would have worked. All I had to do was just catch it. And as you've seen, it definitely works. It's a lot better, like I say. Use a cleaning brush. It's gotta be a real brush though. It can't be that, you know, that uh, plastic material. It has to be brass. And it'll catch. You know, it's great for uh, trying to snake something through. All right, you know what, that's enough. Let me do that. And to stop this from going any further, let me uh, just tie it around this roll so it accidentally can't uh, accidentally can't uh, get pulled out. So I'm working on the other end for something. Here. Now, get all this crap off the brush. Actually, it uh, comes out. There we go. Nice. Good deal. Excellent. Clean off. All right, so I took care of that. So let me roll this up, get it out of the way. Over there for now. You go get some 
new wire. I think that is, uh, uh, it might be 14. I don't need much out there. I don't have much power out there. Uh, no, I think that's 12. Well, I know it's not 10, so it's either 12 or 14, but it looks like 14, but it's got a color of 12. No, it's 14. All right, I'll be right back.